What's up, what's up, people? How are you doing? This is Coach DC of the Intense Fit Way. Where discipline is the way. How are you on this Tuesday, the day after Memorial Day? What's up, people? How are you doing? Um, so today's question was, what is your darkness? What is your darkness? And um, I've been through this with a couple of my clients, and we're talking about what are your what is your darkness? What are your unconscious reactions to life or people that are not helpful, that are negative, that are unconscious reactions that you do on a regular basis that have not helped you foster a relationship with anyone and especially not with yourself? So what is your darkness? Because your darkness is your response to life. Your darkness is your response to life. Most of the stress that we have in life is not life itself. It's just that how we respond to life. That's why my motto is respond well, respond well. But in responding well, you must have control. I'll say control. Or you must have um, some management, some awareness of yourself, your emotions, your feelings, etc., etc. Especially depending on especially depending on who you're responding to. I mean, we understand that, you know, most of the time we're responding to our family that um we have these um reactions because we've seen these people over and over again. We've dealt with their actions over and over again. We've dealt with how they are as a person over and over again. So a lot of the times we have a whole lot of unconscious patterns in the ways we react to each other, especially in family situations. Usually we're a whole lot more conscious, a, a whole lot more honest and authentic when we're with other people other, other than our families. And this is a serious problem because we don't understand that family is our greatest opportunity to evolve ourselves. Family is our greatest opportunity to evolve ourselves. Because they are so close to us. They are the ones we talk to. They are the ones that we know. So there is an opportunity right there for us to become better, more responsible people. Besides, our family knows us. They know our negative reactions, our unconscious behaviors, our darkness. So, again, they can automatically push our buttons on a regular basis. <clears throat> So I say this to say that your response to life, our perception, which controls our response to life, is what will make our day stressful or peaceful. It's always our response to life and life situations, life trials, life people, family, girlfriends, boyfriends, wife, husband, teachers, um, community people we deal with, neighbors. We must be in control of ourselves to have the proper response or the proper response in every situation or to respond well. Because, you know, I was talking to one of my clients today and I was telling her my darkness. And I was like, you know, sometimes my darkness is I respond wrongly or respond out of order to my daughter or wife or because I've been around them so long and, and we're going over the same things over and over again. And I finally get frustrated. So I respond in a negative manner which doesn't help the situation at all. So in understanding my own darkness, my own unconscious reaction, I have to stop and look at myself and say, this is not helping. This is not helping my family. This is not helping me. This is not helping us to become a better, stronger unit at all. So I have to change me. I have to change me because I'm the changer. <laughs> I am the one who changes. I am the one who understands that, yo, this energy is out of order. This energy doesn't work for this situation. This energy is not making us a greater, better people. So I have to change my energy first to help everybody else understand how and why their energy needs to change. But here's the kicker I'm going to put at the end. This is a big kicker. The big kicker I'm going to put at the end is simply this. Most people are not aware of their thoughts feelings and responses most people are not aware of their thoughts feelings and responses because usually we respond we respond just like we did the day before we respond to people the people that we're dealing with just like we did the day before 
usually with the same response, usually with the same sentence and the same words, the same intention, the same attitude. So most people are not aware of their reactions and responses to people in their life or to situations in their life. And that in itself takes a lot of practice with oneself, and especially with oneself around other people. And in the next video, I'm going to actually drop how to change your response. I'm going to tell you my little secret on how I've changed my response from being a violent kid to a halfway, uh, I'll say halfway balanced adult. How about that? And um, still today, I say halfway balanced adult because still today I'm still noticing dark reactions, dark unconscious reactions within myself that I need to check and change. And that's an ongoing process. It's an ongoing process of, of bringing the new man to fruition. The new better man to fruition. That's what they're talking about in the Bible when they're talking about renew the new man. The new thought. The new action. The new words you're using. The new behavior. The, the fruit of the spirit. That's what they're talking about when they're talking about the new man in the Bible. But we've missed a lot of the Bible because we've made it hocus pocus, pocus like magic not understanding that we are the magicians with that this is coach dc of the intense fit way where discipline is the way this video will be right here for this video this is the last video i'm doing on facebook the last full video anyway the next video i'm going to begin to drop how to change how to change that, that renew that new man and I'm going to do specifics on it in the next video but that video I'm only going to put half of it on Facebook the other half I'm putting it on Patreon I'm going to start building up my Patreon page because I've been kind of lazy lately and I haven't touched it but um, if you're interested in this part, the mind part how to change your mind, how to become a better more aware person of yourself so that you can change you, your family, your life, and people around you. Hit me up. Pay attention. Because I'm dropping all my knowledge. Because the world needs to change. The world needs to understand that it needs to change. And the only way we can do that is with the awareness of how to change. But with that, this is Coach DC. I'm leaving this one on Facebook. Everything else is going to Patreon next. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Peace.